Am I up for a question? I am Golden Spin. What's Gucci? I three bet this person. This is not GTO. I just love three betting this person because they play so fit or fold. Uh, I'm not going to see about that flop. Oh, that turn. They love just betting, but you know, we're going to raise them. No diamond. Nice. Love to see it. I'm gonna play this hand at 510. That's a good flop. That's not a good turn. Call one bet. They have to have specifically ace king. They can have aces and kings. So we're going to call. Nice. Good hand here. For sure, going to four bet this player. This is a shove I'm going to fold. Just a call. Well, someone has a straight, but we have a set. Bink? That was very unlikely, uh, given that they had the queen and the knight in their hand as well, but sometimes you get lucky. Here, if we get three bet, we're gonna go all in against a 40 big blind stack. Against this seed, I'm just gonna four bet also. Hopefully, it didn't pop a flush. We have one spade, eight of spades. They have the nuts. We're dead. I sand. What's up, everybody? Dylan Weissman here. Uh, it's a gorgeous day. I'm out in Red Rocks. I got myself. I got the puppy. I got the girlfriend. You know, li life is good. But I I'm having trouble sinking in, and it's because my heart, my heart has dissonance in it. And I wake up with this dissonance every morning because my inbox is flooded with questions asking me where somebody can learn the great game of Paolo Bonobaha from scratch. And I didn't have a good answer for you. But now I think that I can, I can release the tension of my soul because I myself have made a course with upswingpoker.com. It is the PLO Launchpad. And it's, it's a way for me to, to help the community and introducing people to the great game of PLO, as well as help me for not having to answer the same question over and over and over again. It was just causing me a lot of stress. So over the next month, we're gonna have some new content for you. I'll probably do some Twitch streaming. I know y'all are thirsty for them good, good Twitch streams. We might get some guest appearances from PLO legends like Jose Ingram, AKA Big Poppy. Maybe we get Ryan Fee to come out of retirement from being too crypto rich, who knows? Get him to drop some PLO knowledge. Um, but yeah, that's that's what I got for you. I got, I got the goods. You've been asking and so I'm going to deliver. Uh, I didn't see anyone who could do it better than me. And so I just made it myself. Um, and thankfully the people at Upswing, they care about the poker community too. They wanted to partner with me on this journey. And so be on the lookout, as I said, for new new content from Upswing in the next month around PLO and this course launching the PLO launch pad. I think it's really good. I think it's gonna help a lot of people and I think it's gonna help me sleep better at night because I won't have the same DMs every single morning. So anyway, take it easy, enjoy your loved ones, get into nature and all hail the great game. Peace. Uh, we're not going to see about this flop pretty much ever. Get led into. Going to call at least once. Uh, 
Are you up on the session? Probably small. I haven't checked. Down like 1K at one of our 510 tables, up a 2-4. Doing my best not to check my results super duper often because that creates feedback loops of being pro uh, results oriented versus process oriented. Oh, five on the turn. We have a nine in our hand. Two jacks are outs, two fives are possibly outs. Block pocket nines. Get it. I'm gonna check raise this flop. We're gonna keep it. We have two kings and the nut flush draw. And a queen blocker, so we block ace queen. Called. We're gonna pot the turn. We also have the 10 as an out. King of spades on the river. I don't know. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. Probably check. Maybe it saved us money? I don't know. I was, I was planning on getting after it on the river. Alright, this is a good spot. I'd love Willie to 3-bet here. So I can 4-bet. If they don't 3-bet, don't I'm actually just going to flat. Yeah. All right, let's let Willie bet. Definitely going to get this in. Good luck to us, chat. The six is really good. Let's just hope they have a lower flush draw. Good luck. Just queens. Oh no. Oh, that hurts for the challenge. That hurts so bad. Oh well. We did our best. All right, we flop top set. If this dude check raises, he's gonna go all in. So we just get to re we just get to re raise. Just check calls. All right. I'm gonna pop the turn. Hopefully that they hopefully they want to come along this journey with us. They do. Good luck us. Oh god, pay on the board. That was that was a little too much for us to fade. Ah. Uh, queen 578. Yeah, that's that's going to be that's going to be a hard one to not lose to. They're probably a favorite. Why are you always at the mall when you're broke? All right, well, can I get in double suited kings against this person? That's a good flop. Uh, they're drawing dead. That's pretty cool. This is, I think, uh, maybe it's the eight, not the seven. That's an open here. I probably made a small mistake. Because Munker doesn't like when the top and bottom cards aren't connected. We get instantly 3-bet punished, but we're going to still call. 
Okay, well, that's a wrap. Which is pretty cool. We also have one heart in our hand. Yeah. Check Ripperuski. Hopefully they don't have hearts. Oh, they, oh, they have us it's crushed. They have us absolutely murdered is what they have. It's a good hand. Okay, three bet. It's four bet him. Put him to the test. Well, that's not a great flop. No clubs. Oh uh, yeah, we are running very poorly in all in spots, aren't we? Not the best way to play kings, but you know.